I find that oftentimes we as people are a lot more focused on our external appearance and like our external beauty over, well, rather than our, you know, the beauty of our soul, right? So like, you know, we tend to want to look better. We want to look better so that we can feel more confident so that people will think that we're that we are attractive, that people think that, you know, like we want people to sort of have that idea of us, that we are a good looking person. But I found that this sort of search for external beauty is a, is a vain effort. Because no matter what, we are going to become old and with becoming old, we tend to lose that sort of youthful beauty that we tend to associate with being beautiful. But the one form of beauty that doesn't leave, the one form of beauty that doesn't, you know, fade away is how beautiful our souls are. So let's say, right, that you are more focused rather than like trying to appear outwardly beautiful, you are more focused on trying to be a kind person, on trying to be charitable, on, try to, on trying to be like, almost like a light to others, like trying to be that beacon of like hope and goodness and just pure, almost love, right? You wanna be like that loving soul for other people. And that form of beauty, that's never going to falter, that's never going to change, that's never gonna fade away. Whereas with the external beauty, that will. Like, eventually that will change. Like, we're gonna change in our appearance a lot. But we can always rely on our soul if we, you know, build up our soul to be this beautiful thing we can always rely on our soul. Now, how do we do this? I find that the way that works for me is just trying to, well, just reminding yourself throughout the day to try and be kind and just try to be what you imagine a beautiful soul to be. Because I find that like whenever I think about a beautiful soul, maybe this is just because like it's only my perspective and that's like the only one I can really get. But there's only really one like definition of a beautiful soul. And I feel like we should all try and strive towards that definition. Now, obviously your definition might be different to mine. Like I, I don't really know. This is just from my own thoughts, right? But that beautiful soul that the beauty of the soul is well no you're right I need to like actually formulate my thoughts here a beautiful soul for me is someone who is willing to put others other people's wants above their own so we should aim to be like that sort of selfless soul that giving soul and it is through that pursuit that we find that we become more peaceful that it becomes easier to be selfless to be loving to be kind to be giving i'm pretty sure i already said given but i could be wrong i'm very tired by the way <laughs> and when we do this when we get to that point where being this beautiful soul is something that comes easy to us. It inspires other people to change too. It inspires other people to want to be like that. And I think that's just a beautiful thing. Because no matter how externally beautiful you may be, other people can't really strive to look exactly like you. Like that's just not something that's really possible. But everyone can learn to be more kind and more 
giving and more loving of a person. So yeah, that's everything I have to say today. Thank you for watching. Keep running when no one else is.